Hi and welcome to our Jayco J Series 1206 Pop Top Camper. Um, we love this camper. It's a really impressive um, machine. Really, really good to tow. What we're going to do today is uh, set up video. We're just going to take our time with it, explain as we go. In my opinion, these are easier to set up than an awning on a traditional caravan. Um, so we really enjoy it. So let's get started. First things first, latches around the side of the caravan. We pop them open. Just work your way around the van. Coming around to the side door, open the side door. You've got your stabiliser handle um, and then you have your actual cranking handle. So what we'll do is we'll pop the stabilisers down now. Um, I'll just put the cranking handle down here. So with the black handle and just um, go the other way to what I'm going at the moment. That way, down we go. These aren't to carry the weight of the caravan as with all stabilisers, they're just to do what their name is and stabilise. So don't wind them down so much that you're trying to lift the caravan. Stabilise. Pop the handle back, nice and easy, and now we're going to um, lift the caravan. So we have a hatch at the back here, um, and our crank handle, have a look in there, line her up, just pops in like that, and then we just wind it up. Now when winding it up, it's nice and straightforward. The cable here that goes tight. Once that's tight, you'll pull it up. And you can't overwind it, um, but as soon as it goes tight, you just stop winding it. Perfect. Okay. Handle back. Now that we've got the pop top up, um, there's a little bit of a um, order in which to slide out the sides. So both beds out first, so we'll start with the front bed. We have two legs tucked in here. So these obviously support the bed. Once you've got that fully out, we'll then just grab the side poles here and there's a curve on the top, this is the top of it and this is the bottom. Slide the bottom in first and then just lift the bed up a little bit, oops, slip back, make sure it's slid right out, just lift it up, pop it into there. Same on the other side. slide that into there and lift and that bed's now set up just pull your canvas out at that point I just leave it like that for the time being then I'll shoot to the back side same thing again grab the bed slide it out this is the queen bed so it's a little bit smaller than the thing at the front you can slide it right out here are your two poles, same as the ones at the front. So again, this is to the bed, the bent end, into the base at the bottom here. Lift the bed slightly, pop it in, other side. And pop it in. Piece of cake, okay. 
We're now ready to go into the camper that we've got the two sides out. So we'll jump inside, step, lift, slide out, drop down. And now we're going to push the um, slide out out. So this is really straightforward. Again, as everything is with this camper, slide the slide out out. And just until it hits the end there. And now we can stand the, um, the awning on the slide out. So simply grab this pole here. This hook just plugs into that like that. We then just push it out, give it a bit of a wiggle, and then it goes in at this side and slides across. That's now complete. Looking at these beds, the same thing again. Lift it up here, we have the pole. We then get the pole, find that centerpiece. So there's just two little rivets, and just go in between those. We can just pop it on there. And then we just lift it up. Easy as that. Piece of cake. Same at this end. So sink folds down. You see this is actually set up to travel at the moment. So we simply pop the sink back over, like so. Couch, really straightforward. Just grab it at the back and just lift it up, same as any of those type of couches. So going through to the um, bed now, we have the same thing again. Just hold the stored under there. Pop it to the centre between the two rivets and push it up. Like so. Once it's back, slide the pole in here, just give it a bit of a jiggle if you're um, getting a bit of tension there, that's fine. Piece of cake. Right, we'll set the table up now. So this is really straightforward. Simply lift the backs of the seats, cushion, cushion. Cushion, cushion. We find it easiest, the table just sits on two runners there, so we just tilt it back to the uh, left hand side, like so. And then we can undo the legs. Um, yep. Lock the legs in, like that. We just sit the stove up next to this. Right, excellent. Okay, we are pretty well set up here. We'll just shoot around the outside and I'll show you the last couple of steps. So with the outsides, around the main posts, we just have a um, canvas we wrap around. This is just to further waterproof it. Simply tuck that up like that. We're done. Velcro around the bed ends. Just pull it down, there's a velcro strip the whole way along, velcro it in there, velcro here, across there, down both sides, same with this post here, tuck it in the top, all waterproof, just check that the um, slide out it's all velcroed down. This one's undone, so we'll just put that back on. That's nice. The last part we're going to do is install the solid door. So we obviously have this hatch. Um, which we simply take off because we're finished with it now and we take it to the back of the caravan just have to remember what gen that was tucked away in righty -o, we have two hinges here sorry it's that way two hinges here, slide it in both of your hinges 
just a little storage space really to keep it nicely out of the way and um, it works well so that one stays there now we'll lower the main door down all right we're back in the caravan we're now going to show you how to fit the solid door um, these are a really great part of the Jayco's so simply unclip the door at this end and it'll drop onto these two wires at the back two clips there lower it undo this latch here you'll see and twist it open that flap and carefully lift the door up sliding it back slightly and then just run it forward on those runners like so lifting it down into position which is really really straightforward we then have the four locking latches at the base so just make sure they're not going to get caught as we slide it back in up at the top got your top latches to here and here and then just turn your locking latches on the base to ensure the door is sitting correctly All right, now we can open the door and head back outside. We now have our 1206 completely set up and it's really quick to do, nice and straightforward. Oh, sorry, we should probably Velcro these on. Absolute last step. It's just Velcro down the sides of the door and obviously that gets your water seal done. So both sides is a Velcro strip. Perfect. Always something you forget with the caravan. And that's okay, it's part of camping. All right, enjoy guys. Look forward to the next video, cheers.